This is what I'm seeing on my walk. What I see a lot. Well, I see a lot of that too. But a lot of these guys. Hey, want to be in a video? I know, I'm scaring them away. Sorry, dude. I can't flip this. Damn it. Um, I'm just going to look at the camera then. Uh, so Sunday, Sunday I did, um, I, I continued work on a really ridiculous project, which maybe I've talked about before, talked about, talking about, maybe I've talked about it before, but um, iTunes. Uh, I love iTunes. It was the fir very first uh, Apple program I ever used when I was a Mac user. Um, and so despite all its problems, it continues to be a favorite of mine. And so I, I want to use iTunes the way that they want me to use iTunes. I'm an Apple Music subscriber. Um, I was an iTunes Match subscriber before that. And um, the, uh, the thing that I realized is that I don't think they want us to use Apple Music in the same way that they wanted us to use iTunes Match. iTunes Match did a flawless, once it was toward the end of its life, a flawless job of matching songs with songs in their library. Apple Music, not so much. Um, it's really particular, especially about um, rarer tracks. And what this, uh, what this is, how this has revealed itself to me over time is that very often Apple Music does have the correct track. It's just that I didn't name it the way that Apple Music wanted me to name it, which led me to this rather ridiculous um, idea, which is that I should replace all of my music, I mean, put it away somewhere safe for safekeeping um, on, a, on a backup drive or something. But then basically to replace all of my music that, was, that I had before I started buying stuff on iTunes and before I was an Apple Music subscriber, replace all of that stuff with Apple Music stuff. That's how they want me to use it. They want me to go in there. <laughs> they want me to have their version of things, their canonical version of things. And, and this way I'm not dealing with any... Um, clean versions of, uh, of tracks with naughty words in them, which is a, 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 a thing I hate. Um, and I'm not dealing with weird live versions when I want the studio version or, um, or uh, studio versions when I want the live version. So I've been going through and, and that's what I spent a lot of my Sunday doing was going through and cleaning out the closet as Marshall Mathers uh, once so eloquently put it. I, I was cleaning out the closet of my iTunes and adding in all the, uh, the songs on, on Apple Music. And uh, the, the, the nice benefit of that is that I have, um, I don't know because of their algorithm or whatever, but my, my favorites playlist is now turning up things that I haven't heard in years. Uh, I think because I just recently re-added it to my library, the Apple Music version. Um, it, it's a pointless, tedious waste of time. I have way more important things I should be doing, but it's a stressful time of year and sometimes dumb busy work makes me feel better. So there. <laughs>